and welcome to our Spring Institute Day 2021. Um, and are you ready to celebrate? We got a lot of celebrations this morning. So let's start as we start every year by honoring our colleagues who will be retiring at the end of this crazy school year. And first up to share the retirees is Dr. Jen Tyrell from Sandberg High School. Thank you, Dr. Gay. Good morning, everybody. It's great to be sharing this Spring Institute Day with all of you. I echo the sentiments that were shared in that video. Wish we were in person, but so glad that we were able to pull off a virtual Institute Day and know that we have a great day planned. District 230 is special because of the people, and I'm thrilled to be able to recognize the Carl Sandburg High School Class of 2021 retirees. First, we have Coach Jim Fabianski. Jim is a member of our physical education department, and along with Scott Pleasure, really uh, started a phenomenal phenomenal adventure education program and our head softball coach. Congratulations, Jim Fabianski. Next up, Coach Dan Lang, social studies teacher and somebody who has uh, given all of his life and career to coaching uh, a variety of sports. Coach Lang, it was great to celebrate you earlier this year as you coached your last basketball game in the Eagle. Coach Dan Lang. Next up, another member of our social studies department. They're losing two great men, Mr. Jim Martin, We'll all miss you, Jim, especially uh, your co-teacher, Brian Ostrander. Again, congratulations, Jim. And two outstanding ladies from our cafe staff. First, we have Joni Opalecki and Doris DJ Tarnowski. Congratulations, Carl Sandburg High School, class of 2021. You will be missed, and we appreciate your contributions to Sandburg and District 230. And now... It's my pleasure to introduce my colleague and dear friend, Mr. Eric Olson from Stag High School. And I didn't miss the introduction this year, Eric Olson. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Tyrell. Uh, it's my pleasure to recognize and honor um, a group of five amazing Stag Chargers, our class of 2021 retirees. Uh, retiring a little bit earlier this year from the main office, main office secretary, uh, Sue Alberts. Mary Cole from the special services department. Uh, Liz Staroska, family and consumer science. Uh, Cindy Thomas uh, from our PE department and Mr. Terry Treasure, our athletic director. Uh, on behalf of the entire STAG community, I want to wish all of these fine individuals uh, the best of luck in the future. We're so proud we are going to miss you, but we know we're gonna see you around. So. Great job, go Chargers. Now my pleasure to introduce the principal of uh, Victor J. Andrew High School, uh, Mr. or Dr. Robert Nolting. Thank you for that introduction, Mr. Olson. I appreciate it. Uh, it is my complete honor to talk about six T-Bolts who are retiring this year that have done incredible things in a lot of different areas for a very, very long time. Um, from our alternative education program, math department, um, and bowling coach extraordinaire, Ms. Julie DeShane is retiring this year. It's been an honor and pleasure working with her over her time. Food service, she's actually already cut out on us at about December, January, but Ms. Patrice McGuire was our head cook for a long, long time. Uh, Andrew Parent um, and has done a wonderful job for our students and our staff in our food service department. Ms. Mary Rogue, uh, a legend in, in VJA lore. She has been in the media center. She was a registrar for a long time. Um, and uh, one of, the, one of the, the meanest hockey moms you'll ever want to meet. So we, we really respect Mary's work and wish her the best in her future. Uh, and Carrie King, who has been uh, an incredible uh, resource for me uh, as a building rep for our building for several years. Uh, she's also one of our, um, pill, uh, one of our foundational uh, intervention specialists as we went towards our IR room and she's done an incredible job helping kids of all shapes and sizes uh, through their through their educational lives, uh, two former uh, two former Chargers who I think are are completely bleeding black and gold at this point in their careers, but we respect their their journey in District Two Thirty, starting from the north and ending in the south. But Pat Sharkey from our English department uh, and uh, and Miss Maureen Weber again, incredible assets to our school for a very very long time, but also um, still have a little bit of that blue and orange in them. So congratulations to the six. Uh, members of the class of 2021 at VJA. Dr. Gay, I think uh, I think you have somebody to introduce yourself, yes? Yes, I do. Uh, re uh, retiring from the district office, Ann Molitor. It's going to be tough to replace Ann. Ann's been with us since 1998 as a District 230 receptionist, always greeting 
staff and parents and anyone who comes in the district office with a smile. I promise you will be truly missed, um, not only by our community members but, and visitors, but everyone at District 230. She's been a true asset. We all love Ann. We wish her the best as she retires. Uh, Ann is just a, a great person. So congratulations to Ann and all our retirees. We truly appreciate them. At this time, we'll introduce our newly tenured staff that were just approved by the board at the board last at the last board meeting. So again, we're going to go throw this back to Dr. Tyrell to introduce her newly tenured staff at Sandberg High School. Thank you, Dr. Gay, and congratulations to you as well, Dr. Gay, on your retirement. Um, I know you were pictured in the previous slide. We appreciate everything that you've done for District 230. I know that you'll be able to share a few words later today, uh, but we need to wish you congratulations as well. And it is my pleasure to introduce five outstanding members of the Carl Sandberg staff that will that are receiving tenure this year. First, we have Choral Director Nicole D'Onofrio. It's been a pleasure to listen to her students make uh, music and make magic over the last few years. District psychologist Nicole Musil, congratulations, Nicole. Physical education teacher, swim coach, and aquatic supervisor, Mr. Matt Niemeyer. Special education teacher, Ms. Carrie Nussbaum, and, and special education teacher, Mr. Joe Tuttle. Again, congratulations, Nikki, Nicole, Matt, Carrie, and Joe on receiving tenure. Carl Sandburg High School is very lucky to have you. And now back to Mr. Eric Olson. All right, we have a bumper crop of tenured teachers and uh, this year, uh, super excited uh, to have them. They've done a great job in the past four years and they're gonna do great things throughout their career. Uh, the dynamic duo of Mike and Shannon Creevy uh, in our special education department, uh, Dorota Guzzi uh, in EL, Tom Lally in PE and Paige Lombard, one of our amazing social workers. And continuing on, uh, Mr. Jonathan McGreal in the mathematics department, Mary Reynolds in SPED, Joe Siskowski, our DC of science, TEE and family and consumer science, Maggie Smith from the social studies department and Mr. Marty Struess from the math department. Congratulations to all of you. You've done amazing jobs and we can't wait to continue the good work in the future with you. And now, Dr. Nolte. Thank you, sir. Uh, again, going back before we go forward, I think Dr. Gay forgot a, a picture on the slide, but at Andrew High School, we wanna congratulate him on a, on a long and impactful career. Um, um, it's, uh, it's hard to go anywhere in the state of Illinois in an educational circle and not have people ask you, hey, how's Jim doing? So uh, my compliments to you and the impact that not only you've had on our district, but our state um, as well. So I do have uh, six incredible T-Bolts that, um, that are receiving their tenure this year. Um, Brittany Creamer from our English department in T-Bolt Storm. Christy Holbin and Gina Johnson, both from science department and co creators and uh, facilitators of our robotics program. And then Mr. Rich Couric, uh, badminton, bowling, and uh, anything else with a B, I believe. So congratulations to those four. Uh, moving forward, Ms. Elizabeth Rosenstein from our social studies department and junior class council. And finally, Ms. Lisa Rybeck from our special services department with a little hint of art. So congratulations to all six T-Bolts on your uh, ascension to tenured 